What's going on? Tectonic Edge here playing some more Mono Green Tron. Got a tower, got a mine, do not have a power plant or search, so we mulligan. Into a no Tron land hand, that's okay, we keep mulliganing. Alright, power plant, chromatic sphere. We can go to four, which is likely what we're gonna do. Eh. Well, let me see. If we were to keep this, we'd keep the two lands, the chromatic. And we get one other card, probably the expedition map. Ew, it's a bad plan. You know what? Oh. I don't know why, but I'm going to keep it. It's probably not the best hand. It's probably not going to get me there, but we're going to give it a try. And we are playing against Forest Utopia Sprawl. Well, we already have an uphill battle. Let's see if we can get there. Tronland, Emrakul, not what we're looking for. Power plant, Chromatic Sphere. Hopefully we can dodge a pillage. If they pillage turn one here, we're probably doomed. Clothis is perfectly fine. Can we get a Tron land here? Tower? All right, crack for green. We got a Tron land, nice. We got there. Now we just need to find a threat. And keep dodging things. Blood Moon Pillage is a lot they could have here. Blood Braid Elf is going to be something. Scavenger Goose. Alright, that's not a bad hit. Unfortunately, they are eating our graveyard, which is a little annoying. I would not mind an all his dust. But any playable threat? Tower. Alright, well, we're taking at least five this turn, probably more. Did not draw a threat. The one card type in the graveyard is already artifact. It's unlikely we're going to get more in there. So what the likely course of action is going to be is to crack the expedition map uh, to grab a forest next turn. Or they're just going to kill us this turn. That was quick. Vigilance, Death Touch, Haste. Yep. Well, we would have hit Ulama. Oh, that probably would have saved us. All right, we, we were turn off. Still had turn three Tron, just no threat. All right, begin sideboarding. That's how the games go sometimes. We'll take these. They're eating our graveyard. We'll pull most of the big guys out. Anything else? Warping Well has some impact. Yeah, but if they bring in Blood Moon, that's very rough. Yeah, I think this is how we want to run it. Hopefully we can get a good Tron hand, which that is not. We'll mulligan. One lander, we're going to keep mulliganing. Ooh, if it just had another land in it. If it had any land in it, we'll go to three. 
And I think we probably lost it at this point. This is going to be a rough one. Oh, probably quick. At least there's that. I could go for the power plant here, but with no threat. Uh, we don't need an extra tower, but you know what? It's not the worst to have. We are, we don't have Tron yet though, which is unfortunate. See what their turn two play is. Do they have an upkeep interaction here? I think our best case is we need to draw the mine and then playable threat. I'm not sure what they're holding up for. Did they disconnect? Let me check. Oop, camera froze. Let me see if I can... Well, that is nice. It is essentially what we were looking for. I cannot. Camera's going to be stuck like that. It is not unfreezing. So I actually think this happens a lot. I just don't normally notice it. It is not the best camera, it's whatever they sell at Walmart for 30 bucks, maybe 30 bucks. I don't actually remember what I paid for it, but it was the cheapest thing at Walmart. Actually, the computer I have right now doesn't have a built-in camera. Did not know that when I ordered it. I kind of assumed that was standard. I'm grabbing the mine, but I have a feeling we're going to see a Blood Moon next turn. At this point, he knows our whole hand, though. It's going to be tough. It's not saying he's disconnected, but he's eating up a lot of time here. I don't know if he has any interaction or if he's just uh, AFK here. 
Oh, there he goes. And we pass it back because we have nothing to do. And he's going to just deal two damage and probably play the giant this turn. Nope, Blood Moon. Called it. All right. Little Karn? Nope, Sylvan's crying. I should have brought in the Nature's Claims. I was not thinking on that one. Grab the only land that matters, Forest. And hope we draw the Thrag Tusk. I was hoping turn 3 Tron would be faster, though, but... Mm. No luck. Chandra or Torture Defiance. Yep, that's going to be rough. Lightning Bolt. All right. We're going to have five men the next turn, so we hopefully we get a Thrag Tusk. Nope. We just may not see any playable threats. They have plenty of mana. Five mana is going to be... Interesting. That's a big boy. Um, not definitely not what I was expecting to see here. So hopefully we draw a worm coil engine. It's not a worm coil engine, but it is interesting. Um, if we live this turn, that will be very good. He's presenting eight damage, 11 if he has a lightning bolt, so he needs something with haste to really finish us off. This is such a slow game. I am trying to get this thing working. Um, the, the camera, the game's just, the game's pretty simple at this point. Either he kills me this turn, or I survive on a low life, but get to have some fun. Not really fun. Of course he gets that. Of course. That is my luck. So 
Uh, where do we need to live? All is dust. Has to be in all is dust. Or one mana short. The first threat we get is Ugin. Can we? We can't even live long enough because that's a creature. So that is game. All right. Thank you for watching. This is Tectonic Edge signing out.